Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing the Rode NT1 condenser microphone. So before we start, if you watched the whole video and learned something or enjoyed it, please press the like button and subscribe so you don't miss any videos in the future. So the original Rode NT1 was released back in 1997 and then following the success of the NT1A was re-released back in 2013. So my question for this thing would be, is the Rode NT1 still a good microphone in 2020? So we're gonna unbox this microphone and then afterwards I'll do a sound check and then I'll give my thoughts on it. Alrighty, let's begin. So here we are with the box. So let's just go ahead and open this. So the first thing we see here is the shock mount. So that's the first thing we're gonna take out. So I'm just gonna put the box to the side here so we can focus on just the shock mount. All right, let's open this up. And it's kind of hard to see, but here it is. So there is the shock mount. Now the next thing on here should be the pop filter. So if we just lift this up, right in here is the pop filter. There is a quick start guide. And this will show you how to assemble the pop filter onto the shock mount and how to connect the microphone. And last thing here is this metal O-ring uh, fastener thing. And this will screw onto the bottom of the microphone to attach it to the shock mount. All right, next thing. So back to the box. Under this cover, we have the microphone itself. We have a I Love Rode microphone sticker. We have a blue ring and the guide that goes with it. We have the manual. And we have a microphone dust cover. Not bad. And that's it. So I'm gonna put this aside and focus on just the microphone. So here it is. And now I'm gonna quickly show you how to put the pop filter onto the shock mount. So here is the front of the shock mount and the pop filter will fit right in there, just like that. Not too bad. And for the last part, The microphone will go in with the little gold part facing the pop filter. I'm going to flip this upside down. And attach the metal fastener to the bottom of the microphone. And there we have it. I apologize for the black table. I know this is a black microphone, so it's kind of hard to see. So I apologize for that. Alrighty, I'm gonna hook this up and we can start a sound test. Hey everybody, this is Jay Ezra, and what you're hearing now is the Rode NT1.
This is a good time to say if you've enjoyed the video so far, please consider subscribing so you don't miss any videos in the future. Now after this, I'm going to do a guitar audio test and a ukulele audio test. I hope you've liked the video so far, and thank you for listening to Smooth Jazz in the Morning. <laughs> Alright everybody, now that we're done with the audio test, I can say that in 2020 the Rode NT1 is an absolutely great microphone for the price and the audio quality. So this kind of microphone would be great for beginners all the way to experienced people, singers, producers, musicians, and everywhere in between. Now you guys heard the audio. So I don't want to put too much of my own opinion in it because I want you guys to make up your own minds on this. I think it's a great microphone, um, but you heard the audio, so I'll let you decide that. Um, and if you want, let me know down in the comments what you think. I'm also not sponsored by anybody. I literally just picked this up the other day and decided to do a review on it. Alright guys, this is the end, and I hope you all enjoyed the review. I will see you all in the next video. Like I always say, be kind, be happy, and peace out.